Thank you, Judy. And thank you, choir and musicians. We're certainly delighted to have you with us today. Our theme for the 40th anniversary is from generation to generation, and we welcome children as part of our congregation. So we will have a baptism today. Baptism is a sign of our being incorporated into the family of Jesus Christ, and we believe that Jesus welcomes little children to himself as well. So this time I call for the Strawhorn family to come forward for baptism. On behalf of the session, I present Wyndham David Strawhorn, Child of God, for baptism. And now some questions for his parents. Do you reaffirm your own faith in Jesus Christ as Savior and Lord? Do you? Relying on God's grace, do you promise to live a Christian faith, to pray for your child's faith, and to teach that faith to your child? Do you? And now for the congregation. Do you, as members of the whole Church of Jesus Christ, promise to guide and nurture Wyndham so that in due time he may confess his faith in Jesus Christ as Lord and Savior and may be strengthened in his ties to the household of God? Do you? Amen. Let us pray together. We give you thanks, eternal God, that you nourish, sustain, and cleanse living things by the gift of water. We thank you for the Church of Jesus Christ and for the waters of baptism. We praise you that you have given us gracious promises concerning our children and that in your mercy you call them to yourself, making them with this sacrament as a token and pledge of your love through Jesus Christ, our one Lord. Amen. What is the Christian name of this child? Wyndham David Strawhorn, child of the covenant, I baptize you in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost. Amen. And I present to you, O Wyndham David Strawhorn, I invite you to get to know him as he grows up in our congregation and as he goes to Sunday school and goes to children's church and goes to youth group. Maybe he'll sing in the children's choir. Maybe he'll sing in the adult choir later. The Bible says, uh, we will teach the next generation the praiseworthy deeds of our Lord. Part of baptizing children is that we welcome them into the congregation of God so that they may be taught the things of God. Wyndham does not know exactly what's happened to him, but we pray that he will grow up to claim the promises made on his behalf. The grace of God always goes before us to do more for us than we ever realize when it happens. <coughs> Let us pray. Lord, thank you for your grace that not only brings us life, but watches over us and sustains us, that is more gracious to us than we even realize, ever. And Lord, we thank you for Wyndham David Strawhorn and ask your blessing upon him that you would watch over him and encourage him to grow up to know your blessing and to know your love and life. Watch over his parents and his siblings and grant them grace and wisdom and and hope as they raise Wyndham together. We pray this in the name of Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen.
This time I invite the children to come forward for the children's time about Operation Christmas Child. I'm going to try to put some boxes up front so we can pray over them. So if you can 